Welcome my fellow Cerulians. Today I'm in Mayfair. Now I know some of you Cerulians are thinking what's Riley doing sporting the prescription glasses look? Well this is actually a sponsored video by a company called Fermu. They're basically an online based company that deal with eyewear sunglasses prescription glasses even if you don't need prescriptions they've got eyewear for you and uh, they're supposed to be out at very affordable prices so I thought I'd give them a try and give you guys an honest review but before I get into it your boy is hungry I'm about to check out Joe and the juice and give you guys an honest review about that too so let's go Join the juice. I've gone for the sandwich. I've also gone for what they call a yogurt. Essentially, got toppings of granola, some coconut flakes, blueberries, and this particular one is called the uh, the sweet, which is strawberry, bananas, avocado, elderflower, and yogurt. tastes extremely fresh. I was going to make a complaint about the fact that I waited over 10 minutes to get my food given that this is a you know a sandwich sort of juice bar. I wouldn't expect something like that to take that long but everything's made fresh here and it's actually really good. Mm. It's very good. This will definitely make for a good uh, breakfast, brunch, or just for a quick take me out. Also, got their juice, stressed down. So, this one's strawberry, ginger, and apple. Kept it very simple. Ginger is very subtle. I think it's more apple than, than anything else. But tastes very fresh. If I was to compare it to Boost juice bars, I would say I prefer Boost juice bars, but this is it's not that bad. Ah. And finally, we've got this spicy, spicy tuna. So it's tuna, jalapenos, Tabasco, uh, Tabasco sauce, tomatoes and pesto. Quite, quite a healthy, healthy portion of um, tuna in there. It's got fresh tomatoes in there, so I'm a bit, I'm a bit weary. But anyway, wow, that is so fresh. A lot of flavour. Um, quite salty, not too salty. I think it's that pesto. The pesto really comes through. It works well with the the tuna. Mm. Getting a bit that jalapenos. Tiny, a bit of a kick. People who don't really like spicy food, probably want to stay well clear from this part. It's actually not that spicy. And surprisingly, the tomato 
because it's a nice balance. It's very fresh. You can tell all the ingredients in here, they, 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 well, they seem to be very fresh. And um, I like that the, the bread that they use is very crispy. It's quite thin as well. Crunchy, crispy. Mm. So, given that it was my first time here at Joe and the Juice, I have to say I am pretty impressed. I do think it's quite expensive though. Um, spent about fifteen pounds. I think the sandwiches were four seventy. The yogurts were a fiver, and the juices started from four nine five for the small ones. But this size is, uh, I think it's five fifty. So on average, each item that you get in here is about a fiver. So if you come in here, be prepared to splash out a little bit because I think for coffee. Well, it's not a coffee shop, but for a sandwich bar slash juice bar, it's a bit pricey, but I would still recommend this spot. It's really good. I will say the only downside is the price and the fact that you're gonna be waiting for a little bit. Now about these glasses, like I said before, a company by the name of Firm who hit me up. Um, disclaimer, these are free. I did, I did get these for free. Having said that, I actually think the build and the quality of the glasses are pretty solid. Especially when you think that, well, those of you who wear glasses will know how expensive glasses can be. Even if they're non-branded, they can still go up to about £200. These glasses, they range from about 20 to about 40 pounds and that's the frames and the lenses which I think is an absolute steal. I was a bit wary because I was thinking the quality will be very, very, very poor but actually I'm quite impressed and um, I've been wearing them all day, they haven't given me any headaches, they fit well, don't know what you guys think. Hit me up in the comments below and tell me if you think they, they're a good look, I don't know. But um, yeah, I mean, if you're going for sunglasses, you can go to them and get um, sunglasses there. And even if you don't wear prescription glasses and you just want that, you know, sophisticated look, you can go there too. Um, it's very, very easy to order. You just need to sort of know your, your size. Like they have numbers written on the side here. And um, I mean, if you, if you wear glasses before, you should pay attention that the numbers represent uh, different well, different features for the glasses. So if you know what those numbers are, it's kind of easy to kind of tell what will fit you. And um, yeah, so I mean, if you guys would like to get a pair, they've firmly have given me the, um, the rights to extend um, quite a good offer onto you guys. If you were to go in the store, it would be, like I said, between 20 and 40 pounds. But if you use the link in the description box below, you can get the glasses for a fiver and that does include um, shipping so anywhere anywhere in the world if you want to order these glasses you can get from Fermi so yeah that's the end of um, these glasses review and the end of this Joe and the Juice so if you like the video you know what to do give it a like comment below share this video and if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to my channel because I make videos every single week. Till next time, peace. Wow.